Hey everyone, welcome back. So before we start, I have a little bit of a confession to make. I kind of rage quit on this fight. I just could not beat him before. So I gave up, took a little bit of a break, and then went and got a few things before I came back. So hopefully this time, Things will go a bit better. Although, already not off to a good start. Jeez. There we go. Where are you? Oh, we're already doing better. Oh, oh, get out of the way. Oh. There we go, that's better. That was nothing. Ugh. What the hell? I can't get up. Duke, it's over. The hell it is. I can't afford to lose. I had to take back the gauntlets, gauntlet to Milady. Stop. What? Ooh, that's a big boo-boo. Here, let me help you. Stay still. Get away from me, lady. I don't need your pity. Ugh. Stop pretending, Dookie. Thanks. What's going on? Oh, look! The walls! Damn, it's locked! We're gonna get squished! Duke! Try the other door! Come on, hurry up! It won't open! What? Then kick it, punch it, or whatever! Just bash it open! Yeah, this is crazy. So yeah, I basically just have to hit. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, hold on. So I know there's dialogue. I can't see it. I'm too busy bashing this door open. All right, there we go. Yay, we finally got out. Such I feel so good after being in that gloomy place. Phew. At what point I didn't think we were going to make it. Me either. But still, it was fun. Let's all do it again, okay? Duke's having a little existential crisis over here. Rude, can we go home now? Yeah. Thanks, Dookie, for all your help. I just did what I had to do to save my skin, that's all. Well, stop pretending. I know you're a good boy. Whatever. Go away. Bye, Dookie. Take care of your injuries, okay? <laughs> okay, Earl, let's go. 
Hey. Here, take it. What is this? It's the gauntlet. I'm just paying you back for treating my wounds earlier. Thanks, Duke. Shut up. I'm giving it to her, not you. I'm not laughing at the dialogue, guys. One of my cats is desperately trying to get in our room here. So I'm actually laughing at him. I don't know if you can hear him meowing or not, but next time I see you, you're doomed. I think he likes you. Knock it off. I'll be done in a few moments. What? You gave the gauntlet to Rue? I'm sorry, my lady. Can't believe it. How could you be so stupid? You went through all the trouble looking for it and you just gave it to him? You better have a really good explanation. I'm waiting. I really don't know how to explain it. Any other day, I never would have given it to him. But after they helped me and we all made it outside, I got this strange feeling that I had to give it to him. I kept telling myself no, but I couldn't help it. So stupid. I'm really sorry. You really are stupid. Okay, forget it. What's done is done. Milady, don't worry. I'm not getting soft or anything. Next time I see Rue, I swear I'm gonna go all out and bust him up. And then we'll get the gauntlet back too. I'm gonna remember those words. I'm gonna stake my whole being on the ne our next death match. Man, I'm getting psyched. It's gonna be so exciting and dramatic, just like that book. Book, what are you babbling about? Fist of fire, baby. Rue, I'm gonna live fist of fire with you. You moron! What was that all about? Maybe he really is a nutcase. Excuse me. Come back later, will ya? We're busy. I'm sorry, but I must bring this to your attention now. It's regarding the bill. Oh no. Currently, you have an outstanding balance of 2,500 G. Really? Sheesh, I completely forgot. When can we expect your payment? Um, sometime after tomorrow. Wait, tomorrow. We'll pay tomorrow. Is that alright? Thank you. Did you hear that? We're gonna have to get some money fast. If we don't find the relic and get big money, we're gonna be bums. Get off your butt and fix the hexagon. Are you serious? But the hexagon's our secret weapon. I don't think we need to use it yet. Shut up. I don't care. If we don't use it now, when are we gonna use it, huh? Hurry up and get it ready. Yes, my lady. Damn, I can't wait to get him. You won't stand a chance against the hexagon. Rue, you're gonna hurt. We're gonna hurt you so bad. Whew, home sweet home. I'm a little tired. But I had so much fun today. Really? I'm exhausted. Hey, why don't you come have dinner with us? Really? Okay, thanks. Claire? Where'd she go? Did you see a girl come in? About my height, wearing a purple robe? A girl? No, I didn't see anyone come in. Okay, thanks. Was it my imagination? No, that was Claire. But how? Alright. So, first thing we're gonna do 
so I don't have to do that again, is go save. Shoot, that wasn't the option I wanted. Fun. What do I have for my monsters right now? Oh, I don't have what I need. Okay. So real quick, we're gonna jump, jump in here. <laughs> Sorry. And do you have anything? Nope. I'm gonna sell all of these just so I have some money. All right, so, on to the story. Excuse me, welcome back, Gru. Took you long enough, did you get the items? Here they are, the gauntlets and the ciliates. Good. I don't know about you, but I had a rough time getting the earrings. That hag bell pestered me so much. Alright, we're ready to go. I'm gonna put the gauntlets, ciliates, and earrings on Prima Doll. This is kind of exciting. Woo! He's not responding. That's it? Dang, all that effort just to make a, the stupid doll sit up. I'm Prima Doll, not just a doll. Ah! Jeez, you almost gave me a heart attack. Wow, you can talk. Actually, I'm not talking, I'm mimicking. I analyzed the sound from your speech and produced a proper response. The responses are purely reflex and not based on any will. You make it sound so complicated. Basically, you try to match what we say, right? In short, yes. Hey, not bad, Min. What did you just say? Excuse me, I have a slight problem with my language selection. At times, I am unable to process the proper phrase. Just chill out, alright? That's it. Take it easy, Min. I'm sure you can do more than talk. Can you walk? I am not complete, but I am equipped with an auxiliary motive power. I'll, I'll now initiate motion. Huh? Are you alright? I'm having problems with my motive system and stay st st stability gyro. Jeez. Why don't you just say, please help me up? These aren't even hard words. Why am I stumbling over them? So he can't walk yet. I guess we need the amulet. We need that special material to make it. Did you find out anything about it? Oh yes, about the Phantomite. I read through some old books while you two were gone, and lo and behold, I found out where we can get it. Whew, way to go, Claus. So where'd we get it? At Raging Mountain. Wyleth lives there. He's known for collecting priceless gems and minerals. There's a good chance he has the Phantom Knight. Priceless gems. <laughs> I'll go, I'll go. I'll get the Phantom Knight and the gems while I'm at it. I'm gonna be rich. I'm gonna be so rich. Well, if you insist. But Wyleth is a great dragon, over a thousand years old. My advice is to you is don't challenge him. What? Dragon? Wailuf is a dragon? A very powerful dragon. Legend says he can harness the fire in the land at will. Mint, are you really going? Yeah, right. You think I'm stupid? 
You go get the Phantom Knight, and I'll go back and get back the tiara you lost to Belle. Okay? Good luck. Well, what do you think, Gru? I'll go. Please tell me how to get to Raging Mountain. Alright, I'll prepare a map for you. I'm sorry, Rue. I haven't been any help to you. Be careful, alright? Alright. So. I know this is going to be a bit short, but I'm actually going to call the episode here. Uh, the last one was quite a bit long. So, we'll make this one a little bit shorter. And I will see all of you on the next one where we go face Lilith again. Yay! Bye!